Janie was contracted to build two large underground ore bins as part of Mosaic's new K3 mine in Esther Hazy, Saskatchewan. These bins are the largest underground ore bins in the world, each holding thousands of tons of ore. The bins store the ore as it's mined and before it's carried up to the surface of the processing facilities. Some of the challenges our team encountered on this project was we just couldn't put this together in one piece and send it down the road like we would with a tank or a vessel. Every piece had to fit down the shaft and then be transported from the bottom of the shaft to where the bin was to be assembled underground. This meant that we were building a big mechano set with hundreds of pieces that had to successfully fit together once they were underground. This takes a lot of advanced planning, engineering and detailing work to make sure that what we build in the shop will actually fit together underground. Many of the big pieces were trial assembled in our shop and taken apart prior to shipping to site. Of course, connecting all the pieces together underground was a big challenge that needed to be addressed. This bin supports a huge weight of ore, so every connection needed to be strong enough to support those loads. The initial design called for each connection to be welded, but this would have required a large amount of underground work to complete all those welded connections. Underground work is expensive. All the personnel and equipment need to travel down the shaft, get to the work area, and then back again when the work is over. So the design was changed to bolted connections, which introduced a new challenge for us to address at the shop. The weights and loads mean that these connections themselves were big, with thick plates and dozens and dozens of bolts at each connection point. Since the priority on the project was making the underground assembly as smooth as possible, we worked closely with Mosaic and their engineering partner and construction partner to design bolted connections that could carry the loads and be assembled quickly. Then, we worked with the other partners in the city to get the precision drilling and machining done to make sure those connections fit the first time, every time. These are big bins and it was a complicated, long project, but our team and our partners on this job were up for the challenge. Together, we're building the largest underground bins in the world, and that is pretty special. Get in touch with us at www.jnewelding.com and let's talk about how we can put Saskatchewan's expertise to work on your project.